They sleep properly lah. Yeah, that's what I say. I thought God mm. take the sun away from him no, and then so, give him a no, lamp so to comfort him because no, he no, no more sun. No. You fast the whole of Ramadan and then yeah. after that it leads up to Hari Raya Puasa. Yeah. Which is? Also called Eid. It's like a celebration to mark like the end of the fasting oh. month. So they always say that phrase, eat like mubarak. Yeah. Then what do you all do to celebrate? In the morning, uh, we also have like the Hari Raya prayers. So there's like some forbidden days that you can't fast. So actually Hari Raya Puasa is like the uh, one of the days. So it's like God saying like, go and celebrate. Usually we will go and visit the elders. It's actually very similar to Chinese New Year or like Deepavali. Like, uh, and it's also um, asking for forgiveness. In our group chat, then everyone yeah, yeah. asks for forgiveness. Yeah, correct. Then I'll just fly. Forgiven. Um, that day is like can be quite emotional like, for a lot of people. Yeah. And they were really, I like, heard some people would cry. Yeah, man. they will break down and cry. Like Hari Raya, right? It's actually the whole month. Ramadan, which is like the fasting month. And then the next month is called Shawwal, which is the month of the Eid celebration. Like. So Oh my god, don't they really say don't shout la. I never shout la Budu. Tell her, just tell her, just so. just tell her. After Hari Raya Puasa, then like a few months later you got Hari Raya Haji. Yeah. In my brain it's the Slaughter the lambs. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's also called Idul Adha. Prophet Ibrahim, who was uh, willing to sacrifice his son for God. God actually like bestowed mercy and swapped his son with a lamb. So he wait. So he to... gave him a lamb for a son. No. So like he had no choice but to like sacrifice his son. But then the then God was like, "Nema, you sacrifice this lamb yeah, instead." Yeah, correct. You explain properly, lah. Yeah, that's what I say. It's more of celebrating like God's mercy to Prophet. Abraham or Ibrahim, so we commemorate it by the slaughtering of the lamb. Will you say that this is like animal cruelty? Isn't the like halal way of slaughtering animals already very humane? The Islamic way of slaughtering is doing it by the neck, where it's actually like, and it's scientifically proven as well that it's the least painful way mm. for animals to be slaughtered. So the animal is being slaughtered for this like religious purposes, uh, and it's not like you slaughter the animal, okay, then peace. And it's also not like suddenly that month we are like slaughtering a lot more which I think people probably think that uh -huh. you know what I mean like it's, it's the same like amount that is manufactured and being distributed to different places it's just going to charity like you would have eaten it for yourself what?